Hi, welcome to MyAndyBuck.com. The biggest question that I get when selling a customer a new Lincoln with the Sync system is, I love how you can use your USB flash drive to play music in my car. But Andy, I have so many CDs, how do I get those CDs on my flash drive? I usually reply with the fact that you need to change them into MP3s and most people ask me how to do that. This is going to be a tutorial to show you how to do that. The first thing you'll want to do is open up your Windows Media Center. Run down to the Start button on your computer, open up All Programs, and go to Windows Media Center, which on mine happens to be all the way at the bottom. The program will come up, and I already have some music in there, but I'm going to show you how to do this. Up at the top, you'll see a button that says RIP. If you pull the drop-down menu on that, you'll see that there is a button that says More Options. When you click on More Options, it'll give you format settings. What you're actually going to do is rip the CDs that you have purchased into an MP3 format. So what you'll want to do is over here on Format, it will already be set up to do Windows Media Audio. You'll want to set it on MP3. You'll want to click the button that says RIP CD when inserted. And down here at the bottom, you'll want to set the audio quality on 192 kbps. That seems to be a really good quality level to give you good quality music and also not take up too much space. Then you'll click Apply. Then OK. Next, you'll want to take a CD. This is a CD that I've purchased, and you'll want to take that and put that into your computer. When you put the CD in your computer, it will automatically recognize that it's in there, and because you click the box to say automatically rip CD, it will automatically start ripping. If you pull open the tab up here that says rip, you'll see that it's starting to pull down all of the music that's on the CD. It rips the music, and it also names the tracks and tells you who the artist was and who the composer was. After you are done ripping, you simply take a flash drive, put this into your computer, easier said than done apparently, Your computer will recognize that it's found a, a um, item, and Windows Media Center will recognize that a flash drive has been connected. You can name your device, I always just leave it the default, which is flash disk, and click finish. Over on the side, you'll see where it says flash disk. What you're going to want to do is drag your songs over to here that you want to put on there. Simply pick the songs that you want. The artist in this case was Bob Carlyle. So we're going to go down to Bob Carlyle. Choose the songs that you want. If all of them, just choose them all. And drag them right over to the side. As you click and drag songs, you'll see them being added to the list over on the side. 
then simply click at the bottom it says start sync you'll see that it says synchronizing and over on the side it'll say you can now disconnect your flash disk those songs that you just ripped off that CD are now on your flash drive ready to be played in your USB port on your sync equipped vehicle. Thank you for your time and I hope this helps.